Speaking of it, Music City ready to kick off another year of Let Freedom Sing, Nashville's annual 4th of July celebration. And that's where we find Peyton Kendi live near Broadway stage and gives us a live look at all that goes into making a moment like this happen. Good morning to you, Peyton. Blake and Nikki, good morning. This is the calm before the storm, hopefully not literally, but just in terms of people who are going to be coming here to downtown Nashville. And pretty soon, this sky will be illuminated with fireworks. And as we've been saying all morning, this is known to be one of the biggest and greatest firework displays in the country. So I want to learn a little bit more about that. I have Julie Heckman, who is the force behind the fireworks here. And, you know, we keep hearing this is one of the biggest displays, the greatest displays you know but what goes into that and and why why do we keep saying that you know the Nashville show is one of the largest in the country and it is by far the largest live event on July 4th because all components are live from the performers on the stage to the drones that will enhance the show tonight to the fireworks being choreographed to the live Nashville Symphony which is really a special treat but I think what also makes this special is that you're going to see over 35,000 pounds of explosives go up in the sky tonight. There are over a thousand flares and specialty ghost shells, which is an image that you'll see and then sh it's gone magically. Also, look for the nautical shells. That's like fireworks doing a ballet on the water. So if you can sit on the riverfront, you will get a real treat. That is incredible and sounds like such a spectacle to see. And you could do this anywhere in the country. We were talking about all the other locations that were available for you to, to go and put on this show. But why did you choose Nashville and what's so special to you about Music City? You know, Music City, Nashville is the friendliest city in America. And what better place to celebrate Independence Day than with everyone who wants to be together. And this event is free to the public, which is also a very unique treat compared to other destinations. But the riverfront allows really a beautiful choreography of the fireworks versus an all vertical show. So you want to see those low level frontal components, including the nautical shells, um, which really make the show spectacular. So much that goes into it. Thank you for sharing just a taste of all of those behind the scenes elements. And really, there are so many options for you to come down and get a seat to enjoy this show. We're going to have a full list of all those locations up on our website, WKRN.com. But truly, I believe if you're in the area, there's not a bad seat in the house. Guys, back to you.